Hey everyone, just a quick check-in for me today. I thought I'd update you on how the bird bath has been going. So it's taken a few days, but they seem to have taken to it really well. Um, so as expected, this wood pigeon is wallowing right down in the water and um, also seems to be hogging the bath from this coloured dove as well. What you can see here is very stereotypical bathing behaviour that you can see in uh, lots of different birds. Each feather has a muscle attachment uh, on it which allows them to fluff up their feathers like this. And once they've got their feathers like this, they can flick their wings rapidly really fast in and out of the water. And this helps them lower their breast feathers. And then they rapidly flick their head back to douse the water onto their backs, um, which allows the water to get all over their body. So I'll show you this again in slow motion quickly. Um, so the, the wings start flicking and then they lower their breast and then flick it back nice and quick um, to, to douse their back with the water. And that's you see that in lots of birds. When they when the water does hit the backs, uh, they lower the feathers really quickly um, because that forces the water down to the skin and that cools them down and removes all the parasites and dust under the feathers. Um, so that's what they're trying to do here. I've also had some sparrows on the bath. Sparrows enjoy a bath when there aren't any wood pigeons around to scare them off. They wash themselves in the same way, but they won't stay in the water quite so long as the wood pigeons do. Finally, this starling uh, isn't after a bath, but um, after a drink instead. Um, you can see how it's using gravity to tip the water down its throat. And I've talked about this in a previous video. Um, this is common in all birds except pigeon doves. They're the only ones that can siphon water straight down their throats without relying on gravity. So I hope this shows you that once the birds are used to it, and it has taken a few days, bird baths really work well, um, especially in the hot weather we had and the weekend just gone. And they're really vital for these birds. So go out there and have fun making one.